we're in Waikamoi Preserve right now. The Nature Conservancy's Waikamoi Preserve on East Maui. And what we're seeing right now is incredibly special. About 95 to 99% of everything that we're seeing and hearing and touching is native. Some of it found nowhere else in the entire world. Being endemic, a lot of rare species, a lot of critically endangered species. This kind of place, this preserve, and a lot of the work that the Nature Conservancy does is protecting very rare special places like this. Hawaiian forest birds are in a desperate state of affairs. Unfortunately, a lot of them have gone extinct and are on their way to imminent extinction. There are four species of forest birds that we will lose to extinction in the next 10 years if we don't take critical action right now. TNC is working very hard to save the remaining forest birds and to take pretty extreme measures to try and save these species from extinction. One of these is uh, essentially a way to deal with avian malaria. Mosquitoes are causing avian malaria and causing these steep declines in these bird species. So what we're doing is working with people to actually bring in a type of mosquito that will render the population to go sterile or cause the populations of mosquitoes to crash, thereby giving our birds a chance to hang on for a little bit more. The Hawaii's Vanishing Forest Birds is a nature conservancy project that essentially describes all of our work to save all of the forest birds from extinction. There's two species on Kauai that are in danger of imminent extinction. The Akikiki has less than 40 individuals left in the wild. The Akeke has um, just a little bit more, so really could go extinct in the next four years. Two species on Maui, the Maui parrot bill or Kiwi Q, whose habitat we're standing in right now. This is one of the only places in the world where you could see an endangered Kiwi Q, as well as the Kohe Kohe, the crested honey creeper. These species really need our help right now. So the Nature Conservancy is working to protect habitat, to do measures like translocation or captive breeding if, if necessary, and to suppress mosquitoes to save them. It is a tough job and it's really scary, so we need to take action now.